I believe that our cuisine, which is authentic Delhi cuisine, is really one of the finest in the world. And so many of these recipes have actually never travelled out of our homes. Tell us three things you love about the Delhi monsoon. Well, the city becomes lush green, chai, pakora, mangoes, and all the wonderful food that is cooked during the monsoons in Delhi. What's your favourite food for this season? Ali mirch, pima, our besani roti and aam ki chutney. That's a regular Delhi wala monsoon a special. What are you cooking today? Today I'm just going to make chicken korma, regular murk korma, which is uh, very popular at weddings, banquets, parties, and uh, it's just one of those all-time favorite recipes. It sounds delicious. What are the ingredients being used? Regular ingredients, we have plus, uh, garlic paste, uh, adrak paste, this ginger and uh, some uh, cardamoms, uh, peppercorns, cloves and uh, mace, uh, jaipal jhabitri, disco cafe, that. And of course, the main, one of the main ingredients in any of our foods is this um, fried golden fried onions and we keep them uh, ready before because that really cuts on time so this is something in Delhi wala homes you'll always find just how did you fall in love with cooking um, long story because I was um, in New York in about 1978 and I really missed comfort food and then my Appa Seda who bought me up and she was my surrogate mom really old family retainer and she trained me and she said, you know, you, all women have to learn cooking and otherwise people will say, I never taught you and Mary Bezat Yogi. So it just came. I put the cardamoms earlier, the elanchi, and now we just turn this in it with a little water a bit. So we just fry them a bit so that it uh, releases the uh, oil and then we just uh, put in the uh, chicken. Wow, it smells amazing. Do lots of people drop in for a meal at your home? Well, I believe in keeping an open house. So yes, we always have people, friends, my son's friends, my friends. They will just keep dropping in for meals all the time. And I feel very blessed because I think the best food is food that is shared. So is there a secret to why your food always tastes so good? The secret ingredient is love because when you cook with the intention that people will come and enjoy your food and come and spend time in your house, it's just always a very special feeling. I see a box of Delhi Mirch there. Any particular reason why you're using that? Uh, in Korma, if you really want the rich Degi texture, which is, you know, where the professionals cook it in the Degs with the big cauldrons. So if you want that uh, color, um, the deep red, you have to mix it with a bit of Degi Mirch because um, the other Mirch is not that red. Red chilli always reminds me of my Nani, my, my mother's mother. She always carried red chilli under her, um, her white cotton, you know, tent-like burqa and she said that if anybody harassed her, it was a secret weapon and she'd just throw it into their eyes. That's a wonderful idea. <laughs> Ladies, take note. So your book says Jasmine and Gin. Have you ever encountered a gin before in your life? Well, I think they kind of uh, always were around in my old house, in my ancestral house, Shama Koti, which was on Siddhar Patel Mark, and it was huge and it had these, all these gardens and open spaces. And we heard sounds um, throughout the night. And then just before, uh, 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 the, before sunset, at the time of dusk, there was uh, like a gin break. We had to move indoors because um, Amma said that this was the time that the gins came out. So we should really not, uh, uh, you know, block their way. And of course, you know, the jasmine and gin story. Um, I mean, you know, jasmine, uh, the smell, the fragrance of jasmine really defines my childhood. And so we just put it to simmer and it will be done in like, chicken cooks very, uh, very quickly. So it would be another 10 minutes on simmer and then it's done. That's an interesting looking cover. Yes, thank you. What are you. all these images on it? Well, that's um, 
of course me that's my brother and me in our younger days and that's biryani that's kheer this is the idea of the dastarkhan the table spread and these are uh, this is shama magazine khilona magazine bano uh, magazines that my uh, father bought out urdu journal monthly uh, which we published and at the back there is um, shama koti where we uh, lived and this is the house where i was born on sardar patel mark and uh, that's me in my younger days i guess and uh, of course india gate and that's uh, a deg a traditional um, deg which uh, which is uh, used for by the professional cooks that's stew being cooked in it and that's a silbatta just be masale piste hand crushed and of course there are various spices and ginger and garlic and and taste patta be beef and various other things and by the way i think now that the chicken is done so i better go and see